Hello, this is Homemade Collectibles Channel with a review of the brand new Godzilla X Kong, the new Empire Custom Made Scar King figure. This is a posable, detailed, articulated Scar King figure that includes the whip. So this is a brand new item. It is available now. There's a listing below. There's a link for the listing below to see more details about this item and more pics of it in poses and its original custom packaging. And it's a really cool piece. As you can see, there's the head right there. It is articulated and does include the whip and its own custom card, which you can see in the link below. So this was a really cool uh, character for the new film. Sorry, let me put the camera. And we wanted to make a figure from the new film. Now let's do the villain Scar King. So the figure is posable. Here's the front side of the figure. There is the head sculpt right there. It's a really, it was really actually cool, but also challenging to make the head sculpt because it was not like a dinosaur mouth or a animal mouth of like a crocodile. It was more of like a human shaped mouth that had to be, we wanted this figure to have articulated jaw, which it does. And you know, we uh, successfully did that. It can open this jaw all the way like that, roaring at Kong or Godzilla. And you can close the jaw with ease. It's also got that cool uh, paint that it had all over its body and you can see um, it's got the chest detail right there, the legs, and it's got the cool custom feet. The hands are also long as well, uh, the hands right there. Here's a side profile shot. Of course, we have to make the character skinny because this is a really skinny monster. So, and then here is the backside of all that hair detail right there. There's the back, the legs. And you can see it, you, the whip is removable, so you can, of course, attach it just like in the film to, you know, take it off. Simply slide this off the peg right there where my finger is at with the black dot. And you can take the peg off. And there is Scar King's awesome whip. And what's really cool is it also has the crystal detail at the end that controls Shimu. And it's also posable in two places right here. So you can pose this whip. It's a double joint right there and a single joint right here. So you can pose this whip with Scar King. So here is Scar King without that whip. Looks really cool. Um, really fantastic. It was a uh, step in a different direction from what we usually do because of just the anatomy of this, you know, being an almost human character. So it has more than 10 points of articulation. It has articulation right here, which it can swivel like that. It's got a joint right here, so you can kind of bend the leg like this. A double joint right there, as you can see. And then of course you can swivel the legs forward and back, but there is a mold here, a molded piece here to make it look more organic. So just be wary of that when you're posing the legs. You have to kick forward. Same thing on the other side, legs can go forward, joint, double joint on the knee. And then over here, there's a joint for the foot. It doesn't do that much, but there, it is there. On the body here, there is, as you can see if I turn around, a double joint right there. So you can crotch the figure forward or crotch it back. And what's really cool is when you crotch it back, there's actually a um, molded piece here to make it look more organic. So it doesn't look like, you know, it doesn't have a gappage. There's actually a molded piece there to make it look organic because you know this character is so flexible and then of course you can just pose both back have them crouch forward the arms 
Um, you can swivel the arms forward and back. There is a joint right here, a double joint. So run two, and then also there is a joint in the hand. You can swivel it forward. Same thing on the other side of the hand, you can swivel it forward and back. But there's also on both sides of the arms and mold the piece to make the character look more organic. So just be wary of that when you're posing it. And then you can actually, the articulation here is different from this hand. You can actually have him do this. Um, that's because of the whip, you know, you want it to make it more useful with the whip. So he has got a double, double joint right there. Yeah, as you can see, there's the other joint. And then also uh, a joint right here so you can pose that hand. And then probably one of my favorites is the head. So you can actually swivel the head. It's on a swivel joint. But because of the, you know, the mold, the sculpt, um, it's limited. But, you know, we want to make this look more like organic as possible. But you can swivel the head. And then there is actually a joint right here between the head and this piece here. So you can actually, Scar King can look up. Not so much down, but he can look up. And then probably my favorite joint is the articulated jaw which I think our figure is the only one so far that does that. But it's really cool. I love the, the roar of this creature and just, you know, he's got, he's such an angry character and really evil looking. So I, I, you know, articulation jaw was a requirement when, you know, when we decided to do Scar King as the next project. So, oops, hold on. You can, of course, attach the whip to Scar King. There is a peg right there, and you can see Scar King with that awesome whip weapon that he has right there. So I'm fixing the double joint on the legs. So there's uh, some really cool... Um, poses on our listing for this in the link below to see more detailed shots of this item with the whip and just more close-ups of the head and the arms and the back. This is available if you're interested for a really cheap price. Um, I would love it if you guys can uh, support our channel by subscribing sharing this video and making a purchase of this and or our other homemade items so we can make more and better ones you know we love to do some more monsters like scar king like we did titanosaurus you know we want to do more but in order to make more we would like to sell some so this is really affordable check out the link below you can also send offers if you have any questions or comments about this item, uh, please let us know. Thank you for watching and have a good day.